stuff. You gonna tell her? Tell her what? <laughs> Dude, you look at Olivia the way my mom looks at her Bentley. <laughs> oh, whatever, man. You tripping? Tripping? Yeah, I call it how I see it, man. <laughs> Hey, who's ready to play football? Hey, you okay? Yeah, yeah, I was actually looking for Jordan. He's gone MIA and he's not answering his phone and my mom's on a warpath. So I figured it was safer for him if I found him first. Yeah, I heard about the fight. The track coach said he might be back here, is he? No, sorry, just me. Okay. Um, thanks. Yeah. Wait, why are you still here? Isn't football practice way over? I've just been getting an extra time in the weight room and on the field. Guys are all riding high on the championship, but my ranking took a major hit last season. Best thing I got going for me right now is a junior college, and that's... that's not good enough. Seven on sevens might be my best chance to get back on a D1 school's radar. What? I'm just proud of you. Well, I will let you get back to it. Yeah. Wait, are you two? Oh, no. no. Oh, well, that's too bad. You look cute together. Please, sit. Sit. Tell me. Are we done here? Finalizing this is the best thing for everybody. Hey, sorry I'm late. You doing all right, birthday girl? Not even close. I... Hey, Liv. You okay? You kind of just took off. Yeah, I just need to find Jordan because we have to go. Hey, look, that kiss. You know she just did that, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, she was just using you to get back at Spencer, or me, or both of us. I, I don't really know. I mean, not that you, you know, kissing her or really anyone would, you know, be getting back at me or whatever. It's... I need to go get a ride, because I think Jordan left without me, so. Uh, before you go, I haven't really had the chance to give this to you. Happy birthday. A burner phone? Like, for drug dealers? A prepaid cell. Like, for friends who have lost their phone privileges. <laughs> I programmed in your sponsor and me. Available for ice cream deliveries. <laughs> I love it. Thank you. It's no big thing. Yeah, it is. It's my only gift. Party's over! Oh my god, that's my mom. Didn't know this thing got texts. Got you that fancy flip phone. And this. <gasps> Ooh. Can never turn down ice cream. But you do know most delivery services wait for the person to order first, right? It's a bit unorthodox, I know. But, uh... I was tired of waiting. I really hope this isn't just in my head. But after last night at the party, I'm thinking it's not.
Not cool, Olivia. This is different. Mm. Since when do you ignore Asher? Since we sort of... Okay, yeah, don't need to hear details, thank you. Uh, no, we just kissed. And we were fully sober. I don't know, I... I really do like him. So what's the problem? I guess I'm just hesitant to go there with him. I don't know why. I mean, Liv, uh, the last time you guys got together, you were in a bad place. Maybe you just don't want to be reminded of your addiction. Yeah, it's not exactly something you forget. It's fine. What'd they ask you about? Mostly Spencer James. And what about him? <laughs> I uh, would rather not talk about Spencer James right now. Your mom reached out again. <laughs> what? As if talking about Spencer wasn't enough of a mood killer, my mom. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just. We didn't really catch up. I don't know. I didn't really see you at school today. Yeah, for a minute I thought you were maybe ghosting me. Well, I'm here now, so let's talk. About my mom? She texted me. What'd she want? Liv, is everything okay? You're acting weird around me. You think this was a mistake? I, I don't, I don't know. Seems like maybe you do know. Asher. When did you stop being honest with me? I'm just processing. Right. Asha, I'm just trying to figure out what's going on in my head. That's all. You don't need to apologize. I get it. I'll see you around. I'm starting to think you might sleep in there. I needed to clear my head. Your mom left right after the game. She felt bad that... Liv, I don't want to talk about my mom. But I do. I want to talk about your mom and that game and me needing to meet my sponsor this morning because that's how badly I wanted a drink. What? Liv, I, I didn't know. Can you just let me finish? Please. I want to talk about all the stuff we'd normally talk about before we messed everything up with a kiss. I mean, hooking up made things weird between us and... I hate that. Hey, doesn't matter if we're fighting, you can always call me. I know, because you're my best friend. And I realize now that I need that more than I need a boyfriend. I just don't want to risk losing you. I don't want to lose my best friend either, so. That means not being with you, I'm okay with it. Nice shot. Thanks. No, I, I'm just saying, if Spencer hadn't transferred to Beverly, taking my position and all my stats, I'd have definitely made that top 300 list. So what did your dad say? I haven't seen him yet. Things are good between us now, but whenever football comes up, I always feel like he's disappointed in me. So maybe talk to your mom instead. Wait, where did that come from? She asked to meet me for coffee. What? She wants you in her life and thought maybe I could help. She waited too long, Olivia. She could have reached out months ago. Yeah, but what if she couldn't? What do you mean? I don't know. She said she'd never willingly walk away from her son. Okay, but she did, so... Which makes me wonder if someone made her stay away. I don't know, she said something about this being between her and your dad. Oh, my dad? No, he would never do something like that, so... People do mess up things when they're hurting. How will at least you know the truth? I don't know what I'd do without you, man. Seriously, you've been the one person that stood by me. Well, that's what friends are for, right? Friends. We should get in. Liv. Come on, it'll be fun. Come on, Liv. 
We're more than friends, Olivia. We've already had this conversation. I know. I know, but if I've learned anything this last week, it's that I don't want to be dishonest. I'm sorry, but I don't want to be just friends. Asher, your friendship is the best thing in my life right now. Why risk that? The chance of something even better. But, but what if? What if? What if I told you I'm in love with you? What if I kissed you right now? If you don't want me to kiss you, you better say something. Divide and conquer. No, no, mm -mm, no, not playing the third wheel to the Asher Live reality show today. Sorry. Don't even listen to him, Ash. I, you can roll with me and Dylan. So you and Olivia are a thing now, right? Like, for real, for real? Yeah. You better treat her right, because as soon as I turn 18, she'll be the first person I call. You know you're going to have a fight on your hands, though. OK. All right. All right whatever if you're cool with that, man. Yeah, I'm cool. He was pretty badass with those cops today. Yeah, you were pretty badass, too. I didn't do that much. You called the owner out on her BS. You spoke up. Well, yeah, because she tried to blow up our lives. The same way Barbecue Becky did. Guess I can add Froyo Ingwell Black to the list of things I can't do. You know, that Froyo lady needs her own nickname. Froyo Fanny? <laughs> <laughs> OK, that's pretty good. Um... Crenshaw Kathy. Ooh. Mm. Yes. <laughs> yes, you win. It's crazy. You hear about the barbecue Beckys and the doorman Daves of the world, and you think you know how bad it is. But truth is, until today, I had no idea. Guess we got to get out of our Beverly Hills bubble more often. Yeah, I guess so. Where? Who said I was excited? I mean, if I have to try on one more pair of frilly white gloves, I will cut my hands off and protest. Hey, she's been dreading this thing since she heard about it. Why? It is pretty hard. Three. Yeah, you, you could have taken a break to make at least one of my dance practices. I mean, that's exercise too, you know. She said it was easy to learn, so. It is, but there's only one practice left. And I will be there. The beast will be ready, I promise. Liv, what the hell? You're off the hook for Cotillion. I found another escort. Wait, wait, what are you talking about? I asked if it was okay that I skipped the practice. You said it was fine. What was I supposed to say? Please, don't break your promise to me again. Uh, yes. Or even no, it's not fine. At least I would have known. What guy doesn't know what fine means? You really wanted me to pass up the chance to work with a Super Bowl MVP? No, I wanted you to care about what's important to me, too. I do, but this is my future that we're talking about, Liv. Okay, not some dance for some stupid club you didn't even want to join in the first place. Well, if that's really how you feel, then it's a good thing you're not going. Liv, wait, I'm... Congratulations, I guess. You didn't tell me you were getting an award. I didn't know. I came to apologize to my girlfriend, but it looks like uh, you're doing just fine without me. I wanted you here, but you made your priorities crystal clear. Look, football is all that I have, Liv. I, I don't get to pick and choose and get an award for whatever I want, all right? What the hell's wrong with you? Easy. I think you should, you should leave, Ash. Fine. Honey, are you listening to me? Live. 
I am so sorry about last night. Like, I didn't mean any of those things that I said, and I should have been there. Just shut up. Okay, you're here. Everything else can wait, okay? If you're worried about my parents walking in on us, they're both gonna be gone all morning. Sorry. I've got my weekly breakfast with my mom. Do you not wanna go? She's making an effort, so I might as well give her a chance. So if it's not that, then what is it? It's just something that your dad said at practice. He told Spencer as soon as he's healed up, his starting spot's waiting for him. But that's my spot. I've been playing the best football in my life. What more do I have to do to prove myself? You can still be a star with Spencer on the field. I mean, as long as you're playing well, scouts will notice. Just keep working hard. I don't know how much harder I can push myself, Lev. Jordan and JJ went to another frat party and ordered me a ride home, but for some reason I ended up here. Yeah, that was my idea. I was hoping to challenge the arm wrestling champ. He told you about that? <sighs> I must look like a total idiot tonight. Didn't sound great. Thanks. Hey, we're always honest with each other. Right? Right. So what's going on with you? I've, I've just been feeling a lot of pressure lately. And I haven't been handling it well. It's made me do some things that I shouldn't be doing, like... Like getting drunk and arm wrestling frat guys? <laughs> yeah, exactly. And, you know, with you in recovery, I should... You're allowed to be stupid once in a while. Hey, just be careful. I don't want anything to happen to you. What are we celebrating? Peace and quiet. Between your house and mine, we can barely get an hour alone together. And it's safe to say that we were not the best versions of ourselves the first time we slept together. So consider this a proper reset. <laughs> Baby, this is so sweet. But I don't need any of this. I just need you. Is this, is this too much, or...? No. No, this is, uh... Seriously, like, the sweetest thing anyone has ever done for me. We promised to be honest with each other, right? So you tell me if there was something going on? Yeah, of course. What are you... What are you asking me, Liv? Are you using steroids? This off-season needed to be my comeback. I can't be around somebody who uses drugs. No, it's not, it's not the same thing. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you don't think that you can perform without it, that's an addiction in my book. So yeah, it's the same thing. Okay. Okay, I'm done, I promise. So you're gonna stop? Just like that? I can't afford to lose you. Okay. Hey! Sorry I missed the game. Hey. Um, I heard you crushed it, though. Yeah, it's all good. I know it's your mom's big day. Speaking of that, I got you something. Contain your excitement. <laughs> <laughs>
Ashley, okay? Ashley, okay? Yeah. Yeah, I just, uh... Just got something in my eye. Uh, that guy that just left, he's the lead recruiter for Coastal California. He invited me out for a visit. How awesome is that? That's, um, really... Uh, really great, babe. Do you want to go get some neat? Actually, I should probably get home. This polls are closing soon, so... I'll text you later, okay? Yeah. Okay. Ashley's probably never gonna forgive me for this, but, um... I don't know what else to do. And I'm really scared for him. Yeah, what is it? It's okay. You can trust me. Um... Asher's using steroids. I tried to get him to stop, and I'm pretty sure that he used again before today's game, and I, I just, it's I don't okay, know. It's okay, come here, it's okay. I don't know how to it's help okay, him. It's okay. So this is my fault? I didn't say that. Yeah, but you were thinking it. I just can't believe you told your dad. I felt so blindsided. Okay, well, so did I. When you lied to me, you said you stopped using, and then you started again before the scrimmage. I didn't lie. Okay, I meant it when I said it. You should have just given me a heads up you were telling him, Liv. Why? So you could lie to him too? You betrayed my trust. You were relying on a drug as a quick fix. And in my experience, Asher, that only leads to trouble. And I can't be in a relationship with someone who's using. I can't be near that slippery slope. That's why I told my dad. I get it, but maybe he's not just your dad. He's also my coach. I could have lost everything. I gotta go, I've got my check-in with your dad. That was a joke. Bad joke. I know. I'm sorry. Whatever. You've told worse. I'm not talking about the joke. I'm done using that stuff, Liv, I promise. It wasn't fair for me to put you in that position. Well, I'm not gonna lie. It wasn't fun. But I'm sorry, too. I should have given you a heads up before telling my dad. I would have just talked you out of it. You did the right thing. I just don't want you to think that you can't trust me. Hey. I love you. And I trust you. Never have to apologize for trying to help me. Thank you. Hey. Hey. Thank you for coming. I know I've put you through a lot lately. Yeah, well, everyone makes mistakes. It's what we do after that matters. I really hope that's true, because I want to make things right. I had this made to replace the one that got shattered the night Spencer got shot. I know how important it was to you. Thank you. You didn't have to do that. No, I, I did. I should have been there. I'm sorry about your dad, too. I wanted to come clean. He wouldn't let me, so I... I'm not mad at you. I get why you and my dad did what you did. I'm more upset with myself. Because if I hadn't told my dad about the steroids, he wouldn't even be in this situation. None of this is your fault, Liv. And why does it feel that way? Because you're a good person. I'm lying to Spencer. I'm lying to Jordan. Keeping everything inside just makes me feel like I'm going to explode. I don't want you to lie for me. Liv, I will tell them. I'll tell Why them. Why does this keep happening to us? We've only been dating a few months. This is supposed to be our honeymoon phase. I think we need a break. I need to be with my family. And you should focus on you. And your future. And get back to the guy you were before steroids.
Hey. Hi. Ash, I know I said that we should take a break, and that makes things really weird now, but, um, but we were best friends first, and I... I miss you. I miss you, too. We'll figure this out. I mean, we have all summer to sort through the mess we made. Actually, my mom invited me to spend the summer with her on Jacob's yacht. You know, just the two of us, mini world tour. She wants to get back the time we lost. Wow. That's... That's amazing. Yeah. Um, well, I should... I should get to class, so... Yeah. Ash, what are you doing here? If Hart sees you, you... You know what? Suspend an already suspended player. Look, Liv... I've thought a lot about what's important, and I don't want to leave you this summer. Ash, and it's... I don't want to miss this time with my mom, either. So, what if you came with us? What, for the whole summer? What better way to work on us than to be stuck on a boat together? <laughs> okay. Hey, where's your suitcase? I thought your mom agreed. I can't go with you, Ash. Just wait. Hear me out, okay? You deserve to have the summer alone with your mom. Okay, to reconnect and rebuild what you both lost. And I know what that means to you. That's the relationship you should be focusing on right now. What does that mean for us? It means that I will spend the summer working on my podcast and drawing. Hey, but whatever it is, I'll be waiting for my boyfriend to come home so that we can have a kick-ass senior year. <laughs> 